Hi guys, so many revolutionary and exciting things are happening in Africa and this project is one of them. Africa is rich in tons of raw materials. However, as a continent, we tend to sometimes sell our raw materials overseas and we buy them back at twice, sometimes triple the price after they have been produced and refined into consumable products. This is no different in our crude oil industry, which is why this $15 billion investment by Nigeria's businessmen and richest men in Africa, Alinko Dangote, is simply brilliant. Nigeria has the largest oil reserve in Africa, making it the 11th largest crude oil reserve in the world. Yet they import most of their fuel and tend to face fuel scarcity. Nigeria produces an estimate of 2 million barrels a day of crude oil, yet they have only been able to refine less than 100,000 barrels of this. Crude oil is a fossil fuel, which when refined, produces products such as petrol and diesel. If a crude oil barrel costs X dollars, the process of refining the oil into petrol and diesel, plus taxes, transportation costs, retail costs, actually places the produce at twice the price of the original crude oil. In 2018, global data reported that Africa accounts for only 3.4% of the total global crude oil refinement, with the largest oil refinery in Algeria. Nigeria is amongst one of the top in Africa, however, their refinery capacity is not adequate to supply petrol and diesel to the whole country and to export. So instead, the country exports majority of its crude oil to mainly the United States of America, India, Brazil, Spain, France and the Netherlands which refine this oil into petrol and diesel and sell it back to Nigeria at twice the price, resulting in a trade deficit in the crude oil and fuel industry. This has led to issues such as fuel shortages in Nigeria and a rise in the fuel price. This, however, is set to change as Nigeria is now estimated to be the leading oil refinery company in Africa by 2023 covering half of the continent's crude oil refinery. One of the firms leading this incredible revolution is the Dangote Group, founded by Aliko Dangote, aged 63, who is currently worth $8.1 billion, placing him as the richest man in Africa for the past nine years in a row. After graduating from Al-Azhar University in Cairo, Egypt, he founded what is now known as the Dangote Group in 1977 with the vision of building a self-sufficient Africa where everyone has the opportunity to thrive. The industrial group covers the production and manufacturing of cement, petrochemicals, sugar refinery and a lot more and is currently in a joint venture with Sinotruck to set up a hundred million dollar plant to assemble trucks and cars in Nigeria for local and international markets. This group is now expanding operations and is setting up Africa's biggest oil refinery and the world's biggest single train facility worth $15 billion, according to Bloomberg. The Dangote refinery is said to produce 650,000 barrels per day and is currently under construction in Lake Friso near Lagos, Nigeria, covering 2,635 hectares of land. They will process a variety of light and medium grades of crude oil to produce Euro-V quality clean fuels, including petrol and diesel, as well as jet fuel. The plant has more than 30,000 workers, covering 9,500 direct work and 25,000 indirect jobs. The geographical location of the refinery is ideal for easy shipment of refined petroleum products to international markets. Dangote has already built a jetty near the project site to receive heavy equipment for the refinery construction. Contractors included in the project are top international brands such as Engineers India, Fabtag, Schneider Electric and Honeywell UOP. This is an exciting time to be in Africa and I cannot wait to visit Nigeria one day and take a tour around this site. Leave some comments below and let's discuss.
In the next episode, I'll be talking about Senegal's upcoming project, the Econ City, worth 6 billion cryptocurrency and has actually been officially approved. So subscribe to All Things Africa and stay tuned.